Pedro, tough to lose any game on penalties. How do you reflect on today's performance? I think it was excellent. I think it was outstanding uh, the way the girls apply into the game plan in many different phases, not only one. We always highlight high pressing, counter pressing, but I think we were excellent, especially in the second half in, in many areas, the way we want, we want to attack the final third, the way we want to attack uh, the defensive line in possession, uh, even the substitution who came later in the game made a real impact to keep the tempo and the coordination in, in very tough conditions. Uh, to keep the ball, especially the principles on the ball, were very difficult uh, due to the to the win. But I think we we, we make the win like pretty much that was not uh, happening. I think the the soul of the team and the energy was there in every single effort, in every single tackle, which is on th all something that we we want to to appear all the time in the games. And then obviously disappointed with the, the last uh, penalty, we have the opportunity to win, and we miss and we uh, they score their penalty. We are playing against a. Uh, Workless players, also a goalkeeper like Corpella, who is an incredible trajectory in the game, and other players who have in the lineup. Uh, so I think we have to also be aware of the level of the opponent. The team stayed very composed and patient today to get the equaliser and, and showed resilience as well to get you know to take it all the way to, to penalties. Was that one of the most pleasing aspects for you today? Yeah, I think uh, for me, I give nine out of ten to the team. To, uh, to be honest, I think we are playing in conditions where obviously we lack a couple of players that are key for us in terms of the talent and the capability to finish the the final third actions. But we are have been working hard on training on crosses on the box, arrival runners, arrival on near post, far post, all the position on the box. So you can see how the players are are ex trying to execute. Uh, and happy for Marta scoring three goals. Happy for players who come, uh, young players who come from the bench and making an impact on the team. So I think we clearly have a squad who can compete and when the moment comes when we recover some players injured that will be we will be in, in the best position and looking ahead to the qualifiers which is the next time that this group will be together what what is it that the players and yourself as coaches will take from these two games forward into into the next set of games well it's to reaffirm what we can do well uh, the first game done receiving a goal we just received one goal i don't know obviously how many opportunities uh, the opponent has to to, to score, but clearly we could have three times more opportunities to score than the opponent. They arrived at two or three occasions, and one of them they were really good coordinated, was a good goal. And that's the level that we are facing. When we play in Finland, it was the same, same level. We were uh, obviously capable to score two goals very early in the game and, and survive in all the moments when the fitness didn't respond because we weren't off, off season. So I think it was a, I think, I think if we even play better today than that when we play in Finland, but yeah, the efficiency in penalties in the final third.